You have got what appears to be a dynamite sound. That's right. 24 to 7 hits. My God, it's the future. This program contains adult content. Parental discretion is advised. Ladies and gentlemen. The moment you've all been waiting for. That's what I call entertainment. It's DJ Suave Smooth. So there could be some side effects. I do. Feel a little bit better? Yeah, I'm fine. You cha cha. Mm-hmm. Get down, man. You know, ladies and gentlemen, we got a person that we bring on the air here. I heard his head's getting bigger and bigger. Oh, Aaron, are you there? Aaron. Are yeah, you this there? Is, yeah, this is all Aaron from 21st Summer Head. Your celebrity. Whoa, whoa, whoa. I'm wait a second. Wait a second, man. Wait a second. Let me turn down the music here. This is who? This is your celebrity, oh, Aaron from the 21st Summer Hits. How are you guys doing? We are doing great. Are you in a good I mood? I got a lot to talk about. Uh-oh. Well, we'll see if we have enough time to talk about all this stuff you have to talk about. What's oh the most... Oh, my God, in- I did a lot of stuff. Uh-oh, Aaron, um, do you know, that's why we got these blogs and stuff. You got to blog this stuff and let your fans know what's going on. What out of all the things that's going on right now in O Aaron's life, what do you want to talk about right now before we take these calls? I got somebody that needs to talk to you about a serious matter, but right now, uh, what do you want to talk about? I want to talk about how... How fun! I had a great time at the Bowling Club Jubilee. Um, I was spent time. Uh, they had their 50th anniversary okay. when I came from. Okay, that's cool. You had a good time there. Yeah, and guess who I met? A uh, good celebrity. Guess who I met? Uh oh, who'd you meet, Aaron? Did you meet some real live celebrities? Some real celebrities? No, um, oh. Dick Biani. The Don't use that kind of language on this show. What did you say? His dick is on me? No, Dick Biani. Dick is on he? No, Denise, no, what's his name? Point three. Uh-oh, he's promoted another radio station on our radio station. He's fired. No, he's, he's, he's fired. On live Aaron, now. you're fired, man. You can't. You can't. You, you can't. broke the rule. You broke can't the do rule, that. Aaron. Oh, man. Aaron, come on, buddy. We're going to have to find no, a new celebrity. That's the name of the guy. His I know. Name is- you don't understand. You just mentioned another radio station on this radio station. Aaron. You just lost your job. Uh-oh, Aaron. We're going to be in big trouble for that one, Aaron. Oh, she just, she just said it. Okay. No, we heard the name now. We know the dick is on you. Uh, but we, we can't say another radio station on this radio station, man. Well... I'm sorry. About now this all the listeners oh, went over to the other radio station that you no, just mentioned. I'm, we just I'm lost sorry. all our listeners. Um, we I just lost the he, listeners. I tell him he's listening on live. Oh God. We just lost all the listeners. Well, nobody's Great. listening now, Aaron. They're all listening to that other radio station that you just mentioned. They all switched over to see some dick on them. I don't know. But, Aaron, you know what? Last week there was an incident that happened. We've been getting texts. We've been getting emails, Denise. Concerned parents. What happened last week uh, with the six-year-old? Aaron, talk to us about this. We got somebody to talk to you after you're done telling us about this story. What happened last week? There was a six-year-old. You tried to play a game with her? Um, I'm not, I'm not sure. Something happened. You said you basically you were telling us right before we took this call that you tell little kids not to listen to the show, that it's for adults. But then we oh, took yeah. this phone call and there was a little girl on there. And at first you were like, we don't want you to listen to the show. But then after a while, you were trying to play games with her. What was he doing, Denise? He wanted to play patty cake. You were trying to play patty cake with her? Yeah. And something about, yeah. So something happened last week. So somebody wants to talk to you. Somebody who's doing an investigation on this whole thing. Uh, we got the caller there. Caller, are you there? How you doing? Caller, this is O. Aaron from 247Hits.com. Um, how you guys, how you doing today? Good. I am Chris well, Hansen with Dateline NBC, and we're doing a story on computer predators. Okay. How you doing, Dave Hansen? How you doing today? Good. Are you okay? Yeah, I'm okay. I'm just, I'm just so happy to be on the radio station. 
So why would a man with so much to lose risk everything to meet a child for sex? I have for sex? I don't do sex. That's right. Could you explain yourself? Explain what? 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 What's there to this, uh, explain? Then why do you do it? I don't. I don't. I don't do sex. We act like this is some big joke here. But I, you know, I do it. I kiss my wife though. <laughs> well, little kids shouldn't be having sex because kids are young and. And they shouldn't be doing that stuff. Yeah? yeah that's correct. They shouldn't be doing it. Why are you so um, nervous? Um, what do you want me to do for it? I guess you're going to tell me next that this is the very first time you've done something like this. I didn't do nothing stupid. You're telling me a big fat lie. No, I'm not. I am telling the truth. There, I never did all that. So you're the good Samaritan. You know, because I hear that a lot. Okay. We need to get down to the uh, nitty gritty. Aaron, let me talk to this caller here. Um, are you a police officer? I'm not a parent or the police. Police department. Okay. Who are you? I'm Chris Hansen with Dateline NBC, and we're doing a story on computer predators. You like a uh, news reporter? The answer is yes. That's right. So why would a man with so much to lose risk everything to meet a child for sex? Is that question for Aaron? Yes. Sorry, Aaron, I you're don't in do some th- trouble here. What's going on, man? We're gonna he, have- he, he, he thinks I'm doing um, sex. That's kind of an understatement, isn't it? Okay, he de- definitely thinks something's going on because of this call from last week. That call actually will be up on the website tomorrow at 247hits.com. You can hear the complete conversation of O. Aaron talking to the six-year-old past 10 o'clock uh, last Tuesday night. Right, Denise? That's right. So, uh, Aaron, I hope you're not in trouble. We're going to keep taking these calls, man. What do you think about all this? Chris, go ahead and hold, and uh, we'll let you talk to Aaron off of the line at the very end, okay? Uh, right now, let's go ahead and take another call. We got somebody on the phone here. Uh, caller, uh, I guess, talk to O. Aaron. Talk to O. Aaron. Hello. Where is your name? Hello. Who? This is Karpar. How you doing today? I was just calling because I live down the street from you, and your daughter come to my house today, and she kicked my dog. Sorry, I don't have a daughter. Yes, she I did. Think you got the wrong lady. What? You got the you got the wrong. Um, I don't have a daughter. You try to confuse. Yes. I'm sorry, I don't have. I don't. I don't have. And no now kid. my dog needs operation. I saw her, and then I go to. I saw her at your house. Yes, she did. Did you take it to the vet? Why you kick my dog? Sorry, I never. I never touch your dog. Don't lie, you fucking guy. No, I'm telling the truth. I never kick your dog. You shut up. You stink. You stink. Shut up. Shut up. Shut up. Fuck you. Why are you telling me to shut up? My dog. She kicked it. She kicked my dog. Okay, I... I don't even see... I didn't see nobody kick your dog. I'm going to call the police. Sorry, I never touched your dog. I never seen your dog. And then you're going to go to jail. Well, I'm being honest. I'm going to get my lawyer and he's going to arrest you. Well, no, I'm not. I'm just kidding. Maybe somebody else kick your dog. Hang about it. Hang I about never it. even see your dog. You know dog what? Before. Don't worry about it. Um, I don't know Kurt, what Kerpel's talking about. Kerpel, thank you for calling, but uh, I think you got the wrong guy. Aaron, you're always. You're always a person like the fall guy, I think, right? Isn't he? What? It just seems like he's always getting blamed for things. Last week, some guy uh, called and said you owed him money from a gambling debt that you had. Do you remember yeah. that, Aaron? That was yeah, kind of weird. That. that was kind of weird. That clip's actually going to be up tomorrow at 247hits.com and djsuavesmooth.com. But uh, we wanted to talk to you about that a little bit, Aaron. What happened with this gambling debt? Did, did you guys ever work that out with you and the guy that called? Did he ever get a hold of you? No. He didn't? You guys didn't see each other or he didn't try to get it? Because remember when he said he was going to meet you at the bank and if you didn't have his money, he was going to do something to you? Yeah, he was going to kick my butt. Wow. That's crazy, man. Well, you know, we got a caller on the phone. Um, Cat? 
Cat is on the phone. A cat is on the. F- I don't. Okay, I guess last week you talked to Brian the dog, and uh, I guess there's a there's a cat on the phone that wants to talk to you. You are a dog whisperer, but does that translate to other animals too? Um, Do you think I you guess, understand? I guess you- all, the, yeah, all the animals like me. I guess they do. I guess they do. And this uh, this cat definitely wants to talk to you. So we're going to go ahead and put the cat on. I guess if you want to communicate to it, go ahead. And uh, I'll just step in if it uh, goes too long. I'll, I'll have to cut him off. Here we go, Aaron. Go ahead and talk to the cat. All right. Hey, this is all Aaron from 24-7 Hits. How you doing? Oh, you want to play? It's play. It's play talk of war. Are you hungry? No? Um, can I pet you? you? Don't be afraid of me. Come closer. Come to daddy. Come on, come on. Woof, woof, woof. Aaron, come, Aaron, Aaron, we're going to have to cut this off. I don't know what's going on here, man. This is crazy. Yeah. What are you doing to the cat, Aaron? Aaron. What are you doing to the cat? That was weird. Are you barking? Is he barking, Denise? That wasn't me. That was your... That was my dog? My dog's actually in Aurora. I'm in Chicago right now. My dog's at home. He hasn't called the show tonight, Aaron. That was really awkward, man. Uh, Let's go ahead and uh, take another caller here. Let's see if we can get another caller on. We still got time, Aaron, so uh, go ahead and talk to this caller. I want to... I'm having a great time. We got a caller. I don't know his name. Uh, go ahead and uh, talk to him. Your name is? My name is O. Aaron. <laughs> God on the stupid Do you hear me? God yeah, I hear you. what a stupid name. Um, wait, what do you want? Who named you? Some half wit with a stutter. Okay. <laughs> Who are you? Are you are you a fear innocent? Robert Baratheon. Oh, how's it going? Is that how you speak to your king? <laughs> <laughs> Bow your shits! We we want to talk about the king. Great crime to lie to a king. Oh, I'm not lying. I have not seen you. Where the hell have you been? I've been bored. Idiot. <laughs> <laughs> and I've been at the Bolenberg Jubilee. Piss on that. <laughs> What's so funny? You ever fuck a Riverlands girl? No, I don't do that. All I wanted to do was crack skulls and fuck girls. Why well, you don't call me a skull? Back in our day, you weren't a real man until you'd fucked one girl from each of the Seven Kingdoms and the Riverlands. Are you... <laughs> okay, we... Are you from the Disney Channel? No. I'm trying to get you to run my kingdom while I eat, drink, and haul my way to an early grave. (laughs) Oh, God. I thought being king meant I could do whatever I wanted. I guess... I guess I should take over king. Your king commands it. Oh, I can handle it. You were right. Okay. <laughs> What's Idiot. so funny? One Man, you're ball and no brains. <laughs> <laughs> what are you laughing about? 
Your mother was a dumb whore with a fat ass. Did you know that? No, I didn't know that. <laughs> Idiot. <laughs> Okay, you know what? Cut him off, man. We we man, draw the line. I didn't know this guy do once, man. We draw the line, King Robert Barrington, or whatever your name is. I don't know what his name was. I don't know. He you know that guy? Keep on la- he keeps on laughing. I don't know what he wants from me. I don't know. We got another caller on the line here if you want to talk to him, Aaron. Uh, I, they've been holding for a while. Um, caller, go ahead and talk to Aaron. Go ahead. Hello. This is all Aaron for... 247 heads. How you doing? Thank you. Yeah. Thank you for what? <sighs> Nothing. What? Uh, where's your name, sir? Lester Burnham. How you doing, Lester Burnham? How you doing? <laughs> yeah. How you been doing? Oh, all right. So shoot me. I was whacking off. That's right, I was choking the bishop. Okay. Chafing the carrot, you know. What it has to do with me? Saying hi to my monster. Hi, monster. Cut him off, cut him off, man. That was nasty. What was he talking about, Denise? You didn't hear him, Aaron? He's talking about whack it off. He's talking about monsters. I don't know, monsters. Monster yeah, something. he was talking about something, man. I don't know. We got to let that guy go. We got to let him go. Oh, oh man, my. Aaron, I don't know what's going on with these callers tonight, man. We got a new group of interns in here helping out, and uh, they're letting the calls through. If they want to talk uh, to us here, what's that number, Denise? 630-332-0199. We call this Parental Advisory. We're live every Tuesday night, and we got Oh Aaron on the line here. Now, Oh Aaron's got a new clip up uh, with talking to my dog. That's up at DJSuaveSmooth.com. Did you hear that clip, Aaron? Oh, my God. That, that was good. Well, that was cool. That was cool what you did. Well, um, did you have a fun time talking to people on the radio tonight? I know it was a little weird. I don't know what's going on. You were confronted um, by... Kind of. They were kind of weird people. They're kind of weird, weird people tonight. I don't. I can't explain I, it. But I can't understand half, half of them. I don't know what the half of them want for me. You know, we can't. Beggars can't be choosers, though, Aaron. Those were fans of yours, I think, though. Aren't you happy? You love your fans, don't you? Yeah. Now we gotta we gotta get everybody out there to help yeah, us. Do you know? Me. Did you know we have to replace you coming up in a couple weeks here? Did you know that? Um, we're trying yeah, to find a new uh, O. Not Aaron. For another three weeks. Oh, okay. So you're not leaving for three weeks. Well, we're looking for a new O. Aaron. If you want to be on the radio and take calls like Aaron does, all you got to do is go to twenty four seven hits dot com and uh, just go to the contact info or. Um, to the section on there where you can actually email us, and uh, we'll get you on the show. Maybe you can do what Aaron's doing. Could you do it? I mean, I think these people could do what you're doing. Don't you think they could do it? Um, they could. They could try for just for one week. Just for one week, or do you what? You don't want them to take over, do you? No, I'm only going to be gone in Boston um, for five days. What if they're pretty it. awesome though? What if they, they do a like a followers? super super good job? What's going to happen? Nobody's going to be like me. You don't know that. He's one of a kind. Well, He's our it is. I can't but there's also job. other one of I'm a kinds out there. I'm doing such a great there. job on this radio station. He's doing such a great job, Denise. But I'm just saying, what if someone comes along and just does a phenomenal job and he has like so many followers and he's like this huge celebrity? Not worried, man. You got this right. You're yeah, a celebrity. Yeah. Um, DJ Sorry Smooth, did you check out my new video? You know what? I haven't yet. I actually uh, haven't yet, but we got to check it out, Aaron. We, Aaron does videos, as you know. Uh, Denise, did you see it? I'm sure Denise has already seen it. Yeah. He's always um, sitting in front of his computer playing music. Um, emulating his ghost DJ. DJ Suave Smooth. Are you actually DJing, Aaron, or are you just playing YouTube videos? I just I just make videos for for the radio station. That's all I do. Cool. I'm to help DJ Suave Smooth out. Nice. It's a lot of help. Appreciate I guess he's doing it. You know, and the cool thing was is I never asked him to do it. He just started doing it, right, Aaron? This is oh, something yeah, you just started just, doing. 
I just borrow your music and I just I just do all the demos and all that on there and on the end I just keep on saying um, warning stuff that way I'm trying to, not to get kids on there to listen yeah I mean, we don't want any more problems with Chris calling up Chris got you a little bit there he was trying to confront you but uh Aaron, thank you for being on the show, bro. I got to get back in the live mix. We also got some more clips coming up, so uh, we're going to have to get rolling here. Thank you for being on the show, man. Say hi to everybody out there. Shout out to everybody, man. Um, I want to give a shout out to um, Bolingbrook. I'm going to give a shout out to Larry. Hope he's listening. And like, say goodbye to everyone called next Tuesday. Go to 24 Hits. Dot com, nine dollar eleven. <laughs>